Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Fast from Fastcraft. So today you're going to learn how to saw your metal clamp or your kiss lock with your project. So let's check it out. So this is the continuation of the uh, video. Not the continuation actually is the section where you uh, saw your metal clamps uh, to your project and this pattern is in the uh, the link for the tutorial for this pattern will be given in the description below so now we're going to continue to saw the two together if you have a lining for the uh, coin purse you can saw together while you saw your project and your purse so for this pattern we are going to have 66 stitches at our final round and for the metal clamp i have 28 for this side and 28 for this side so the total is 56 uh, hole so we're going to have extra five stitch on this side and five stitch on this side so we're going to make a mark on one side here and one side here so just make sure you have your stitch marker at one end right here and then you're going to count for a total of is now we have overall 66 so your next stitch marker is going to be 33 you're going your marker going to be on your 24th stitch so you count your stitch and make your mark on your other half okay after you mark the two and remember we have total of 56 holes here in the kiss lock or metal clamp and you have a total of 66 stitches so you're going to have extra 10 stitch so you're going to divide the 10 into 5 and here and 5 and right here so first you're going to do one side first okay you're going to start on one side first we are going to insert our needle on the first stitch where we have our stitch marker and then we're going to secure the needle and secure the thread you're going to pull through and you're going to insert back yonder in between these two thread so just insert in the here between the two track okay done so remove your stitch marker now going to take our metal, our metal clamp and going to insert our needle from Inside, so here I'm going to take inside here. Then our work is going to be in between the gap here. So we're going to push our work in between the gap. Just now we have our first stitch here. So we're going to take our second stitch right here and push through, and then insert into our first hole right here so push through back and then that is our first stitch turn back I'm going to move to the second hole insert our needle through then going to insert our needle into the 
second uh, third stitch right here next to this stitch which is this stitch right here so pull through your thread turn around so you continue with the next stitch right here so you can straight away insert with to the next hole which is this one insert and pull through can already see that the work is going to you just push your work through the gap there turn your work and then we move to the next hole which is right here push through so we already have our this now we already pull hard our uh, thread so we're going to straight away push through the stitches turn next stitch if you can see the stitch you just pull down a bit right here and then your hole is here so you're going to repeat this until you have your first side until here so we see you later okay we are now at our final hole so from here we just going to Insert our needle straight right here. Okay, so we're going to turn and repeat back, but make sure this time you're going to you're not going to interlock the stitches, you're going to skip this and going to from bottom here out this line. And insert back here. So you're going to see the thread all the way. There's no gap like this one. Okay? Okay, we do it together so you know what I mean. Now, after, after the final stitch, we're going to insert our needle to the next stitch right here. And into the second last hole, which is right here. So now you see, just now we have, we don't have needle right here. Now we're going to insert our needle and through the back. Now you can see we have all the needle straight and then we have a gap here. So we turn back, insert to the next stitch right here the back here then sit to the next one right here so you're going to repeat this until you finish this side right here okay after you finish done with your last hole you just secure your uh, thread in between your stitches
already finished one side so from here you can see it's nicely so with all the needle or all the thread through the hole so you're going to repeat the same step from this side so you're going to start where you mark your stitch just ignore this uh, few stitches so you just start from this stitch until you have finished your row you are going to have extra few stitches here same as this side so we meet after you finish sewing this side so that is how you saw your metal clamp to your uh, project for your coin purse so i hope you learned something from watching this tutorial don't forget to click the subscribe button below like and share this tutorial see you again next tutorial bye